good morning. <laughs> yes, I know I look like crap. Well, um, these past few days I have not been sleeping, you can say. I've been having, um, you could say, trouble with the kiddos, especially with Nomar. Um, he hasn't been sleeping for the past few days. It's been more than a week now. Yeah. Where he stays awake at night and then he just cries and then he wants to sleep basically with mommy and daddy in bed. And that's not going to happen. Um, I can't sleep with any of them in the bed um, next to me because I'm just scared that they're going to fall out or while I fall asleep, he's going to wander off and fall off the bed. So I cannot have that. I am going to start sleep training them. Um, basically, I'm going to try different techniques that I read about online to try and basically teach them how to stay in their cribs and sleeping in their cribs. So... Um, they're, they're cranky, um, they haven't been sleeping much, um, Lily's also been waking up lately, um, she woke up last night, and she's been waking up for the past three days in the middle of the night asking for bottles. They all kind of tend to start doing that now, so that means no sleep for mommy and daddy, and I need sleep. <laughs> I'm exhausted as it is during the day, just doing everything, taking care of them, you know, um, cleaning the house. Um, cleaning the babies, taking them baths, putting their food in, you know, everything. It just takes so much physically and mentally. Um, so I need my rest. I need to sleep. So I'm going to start doing that today. Sorry about the crying babies, you know. Ow, quads, you know, there, there, there's always going to be a baby that's going to be crying. Or, you know, I'm pretty sure it's because I left them... You know, and I'm over here in their nursery right now. They like to have me around all the time. So, that means pretty much I can't do nothing other than being around the babies. Yeah. So, sleep training day number one starts tonight. Um, wish me luck. I hope, you know, I could get them all to where they sleep through the whole night and don't wake up in the middle of the night for bottles or for any reason at all i know um i didn't have any trouble with alex um which is my oldest when he was a baby he was such a good baby <laughs> he slept through the whole night never gave me any trouble at all and so to jumping from one you know to being so good and just one baby to four and then all of them waking up at night i mean sometimes two out of four might wake up at night and the other two sleep through the whole night but since the other two, you know, wake up in the middle of the night crying and they're pretty loud, they wake up the rest. So that means all four of them wake up at night and then I'm awake at two, three, four in the morning. And I'm here trying to put them back to sleep. So I'm going to do some techniques to um, basically make them sleep through the night so that way that we can get some sleep too because lately I've been so tired and um, part of it is also you know it's really stressful when you don't get the rest that you should be getting because um, it just takes so much out of you I mean um, right now you know this you're supposed to sleep and wake up rested and it's completely different for me I sleep but I wake up more tired than when I go to sleep I don't know how that works but that's pretty much how I've been feeling lately um, I know a lot of moms out there could probably relate to this, even with one kid, you know, they might be waking up at night and not any, not letting you get your sleep and yeah, it could get pretty, pretty stressful sometimes. So I'm gonna, I will show you guys, I am gonna film, um, and record me at night, um, sleep day, you know, the day one, which is today, um. I'm going to record it for you guys, but I won't post it until the next day. So I'll show you guys to see how it goes. And I hope that something works out for us where we can get rest and they can get some rest too. Because, yeah, we need sleep. Big time. I know. You can tell from my face, right? I know. <laughs> um, so, yeah, stay tuned and... Um, upcoming videos I will show you guys to see how it goes and hopefully this works for me and help somebody else out that's going through the same struggles as me right now so thank you guys so much for watching and 
Um, don't forget to like and subscribe to watch more videos. Thank you. Bye-bye. Well, hello. Good morning. <gasps> cranky today. Hey. Cranky? No, no cranky. Melanie, it's okay. Can you guys leave the car seat alone, please? Uh -huh. Yeah, I gotta move that away from there before they get hurt. Let's do that now. Uh-oh. No, baby. You guys are gonna hurt yourselves with this. Um, it's in the morning. They woke up just a little while ago. Um, I'm gonna get them ready for breakfast. Uh, right now. And I have a mess everywhere right now. I haven't had a chance to clean yet. Hi. Okay, that's the breakfast. You need some banana. Lily. Melanie. No more. And Nathan. Say hi, Nathan. Hi. Yeah, they're enjoying some banana right now for breakfast. Uh oh. Somebody dropped their banana. Gonna give her a little piece, another piece. And then they're gonna get some nice warm oatmeal. You guys want some nice warm oatmeal? Yes. Yes. So we'll do oatmeal. Say mass. Mass? Say more, please. Mas? She started saying mas yesterday. She said the for the first time. She was saying it a while ago right now. Say mas. Mas? I let's see. Mas? Hmm. Okay. Oh, Nathan, you're fast. Another piece, Nathan? Just a little bit more, okay? Okay. while eating and she seriously is snoring I don't know if you guys can hear her oh. Oh, oh. <laughs> she's snoring <laughs> my poor lady I'm gonna put her down so I'll be with you guys in a second oh, yeah this is a perfect example of what I was talking to you guys about Lily right here I don't know if you can see her she fell asleep while eating. She didn't sleep much last night. She kept waking up. And this is what happens when, you know, when that happens. She wakes up and then I don't sleep. She doesn't sleep. And, I mean, at least she can get some sleep. But I can't because I got to take care of the rest. So, I'm going to put her down so that she can rest properly. She literally fell asleep while chewing on food. I mean, she's, yeah, she didn't get enough sleep. So let me put her down, and I'll be with you guys in a well, sec. I'll put them down for their nap. Um, they're all pretty cranky. They all started crying, and Lily fell asleep while, you know, what you saw. While she was eating her food, she completely fell asleep and was even snoring. Um, I wiped her down and cleaned her, and she didn't even wake at all. Um, that means she's super sleepy. She didn't sleep much last night. Um, so, yeah. Um... Today, for the rest of the day, we'll see. I'm gonna, once they wake up, I'm gonna change them for the day, make them play a little bit, give them some, you know, physical exercise by them playing around and moving around, and give them their lunch, you know, a little bit more playtime. And basically, I'm gonna start working on my night routine, on my new night routine of what I will be doing. I'm not gonna get sleep um, this week, I know that for a fact. I'm not going to get enough sleep and that's fine as long as everything I do, all the sacrifices I'm going to be making with my sleep will end up paying off um, with them sleeping through the whole night so that we can finally get some sleep. Um, so I will be recording like I mentioned and posting you know, videos and hopefully this helps out some other moms out there that are struggling right now with their little ones. Um, and help them some way by watching what I do and if I mean I'm not saying it's gonna work because every baby is different honestly every baby is different and I know that now every baby is different and what might work for me might not work for you so just you know as a mom do what you feel is best and I wish you guys luck and wish me luck because I will need it and hopefully this works so thank you guys for watching okay